it's been a while, but welcome back. In the meantime, since the last stream, I have all the new power supply. So with a bit of luck today now, we won't be dealing with annoying frame rate drops and the power supply rattling like a... Uh... Oh, I thought I had a golden A-flex. Power supply shouldn't be rattling like a... Uh... A rusty old banger of a car. But we'll see. Um, now the problem is, since it's been like a week and my memory is absolutely pathetic, I don't quite remember what I was going to do. The rocket makes me think maybe I was going to send a rocket that makes plants. Let's see, do I have enough stuff for it? It looks like that was on my list of crafting ingredients. I see encoding overloaded already. It wasn't the power supply. Although the power supply isn't rattling. Um, what are we looking at? Plants. We need tree bark and the erma. The erma erma. Uh, Why do I have all of this stuff? So, I must have been doing something. Face is looking very green though. It's positive. Um, oh yeah. Do you know, I don't know if I have any of those left. I don't. I've probably been leaving them behind. Is there a way to synthesize another? <laughs> I know there will be one if I go back to... Um... Is that new? No, no, it's not. Um, I know there will be one if I probably go back to my original base up on the hill. Seed spreader rocket. Well, which one are we going to try in the... Push out the door first. This computer. And there was some plants. It sounds like they both do the same thing. Plants multiplier by a thousand. And where did I just unlock seed spreader up here? Ooh, oxygen. Well, I don't know which one's most important. Probably not that one. So. So that's a long way to go. Um, we need electricity. Hydration level low. Oh, I'm starved. Have to eat an eggplant for a moment, and I'll throw the rest of them into the the eggplant cupboard. Um, and the harvest the. Created stuff from going here. And that was it. Two of them, and then the, the bark and the other Lerma Lerma. So, what is the quickest way to get to my old base? If I go through the woods or through the Mountaineering, get up. Oh. I require sustenance. I'll bring one. I don't know why I have so much water in my inventory. Something weird happened while I was away. I'll just take the uh, pants as a crow's fly, they say. We should see what happens along the journey. Will I start dunking now into the ocean? See the remnants of my old base, the contents of which have not been refunded to me. So I'm gonna have to live without them. It's gonna be a hard life. What's that now? It's just an old rock. 
Come on! You can do a rocket. Be very disappointed if I don't have to learn that. And while I'm here, let's go into this uh, ship. Try and see about that deconstruct tool behind the um take food. Beside behind the console or something like that. Yeah, this one. There might be one of those jokes in there too, the Lermas. Yeah, where is the deconstruct tool? And there should be something in here. Behind the console. Secret area. I may have discovered it and it's not known, but I'm going to keep keep checking for the moment. Anyway, let's keep mash. Oh, I think I saw this before. I was just clipping through the wall. There is nothing behind it. Oh. What happened there now? I deconstructed something. Well, that might just clarify that in the future. I clip through it a bit. In the future, then I probably will turn on that generator. Fusion core or whatever it was. That will probably open those doors. Which also may answer the questions about the console. So maybe, yeah, I can... Hold off on this until I possess whatever it is to power those fusion reactors. I'll go back and make my one rocket anyway, because the initial thousand makes an all considerable difference. Is there anything else in here I should be shooting? I might take the other way back just to see if there any any uh oh any Osram Osmium. Osmium goodies I may have left behind. I think they can be clipped in. Oh yeah, the tier 2. I think I built the tier 2 of the um, grill. Or I didn't build that, I unlocked it. I can't build it because it requires resources that I don't currently, or yeah, I don't possess at the moment. So, uh, stuck with the old, the OG drill at the minute. Getting all the lava of that uh, sulfur. And uh, may as well take the rarer bits too. Now, spin back to the base and I will build the rocket that will spread seeds. Or whatever the one that is that increases the plants by a thousand percent. So I need to go. Oh yeah, there's there could be some good stuff in here too. Oh, loads! And I'm full up now. Can be done. But I need to make a lot more um, electricity. And I don't have much uranium to build proper reactors, so I'm gonna have to just build a real big uh, solar farm. Which is kind of a slow process. Still going to do it, but I can't see myself getting out of this little terraform and slump them in at the minute unless I just start building loads of heat generators and I need to start getting myself along the further along the way. Um I think the sulfur the sulfur fridge is upstairs. Okay, so we'll rock it. Advanced one is going up painfully slow, so the thousand of fire is essential at the moment, and it all goes towards terraform and gold anyway, so ain't hurting anyone. It's rocket time. Um plants multiplier. Please small spread. Okay. There we go. Hold on, I feel like I built one of these before. Well, so I'm going back now. It's built and it must be launched.
There we go. They wouldn't take some influence from SpaceX and have me a thrust that will return to Earth. Save me the hefty, hefty fee that comes with producing these rockets. Gonna cause a dust storm now. Now, where's my plants? These should, these numbers should be skyrocketing. No, still crawling. Three spreader plants. Oh, we're still, still crawling towards whatever it is we're going. All right, so where's our electricity? Ten. I'm not gonna get far with ten. And we haven't got a whole lot of uranium. That's what it is. Let's just build a load of. Let's see what else I can build. I'm surprised they haven't given me any new power generation things. Like I get nuclear is the most efficient, but give me another renewable way to do it. Anyway, I need cobalt. A bit of aluminium. Form. I need eight cobalt. Should have eight. And magnesium. Need to build a little uh, dedicated solar panel area. But the solar panels don't make much. 19. Like most of the good things consume like 50 units of power. But it is what it is. I mean, silicon. There's lots going on anyway. Still on 57 frames per second. We're not going down too low yet. Not hit rock bottom. But it's coming. And what else? And iron and magnesium. That's it. Two magnesiums are So two more. And that should allow me to start building more plant sprinklers. And I'll have a, just a quick check and make sure I'm doing this right. Perhaps the next tier of the terraforming will produce some plants on its own because I think the next stage is plants. That's what it was called. I'll double check. The next level of the terraforming anyway is plants. So I would assume they'll start growing. Yeah, well, flora, not plants. But here it is coming now, any minute. And presumably that should, that should increase the biomass part on its own. But look, it's 4353 three now. We'll see if that changes to something a bit better now in the next couple of seconds. The gas extractor I built, it didn't do a whole lot of good. These algae generators, great for plants, 23 like. These fellas are the beasts. Hydration low. Hydrate me. It's these things. This thing feels like it should be the best. Why is the biodome not the best place to go grow plants? Eleven. Oh yeah, I think I'm actually waiting for trees to unlock. Once I have trees, and um, tree seeds. Also, I gotta get insects first. So I got the eighty tons of plants. Come on, hurry up! It's our power situation. Eighty-eight. And we need to get, I think heat, just because I'd like to have this nuclear fusion generator. I think life would be easy once I get that. But I'll focus on heat for a bit. Unless, ooh, iridium rods. Those things don't grow on trees. Two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Uh, me too. I'll make more, one more heater anyway. I have two rods then, and I think I have some explosive powder upstairs in the manufactured items fridge. Do, 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 do. Come on! All of these terraforming transformations are total paint drying. Four, three, five, three. Trees will, trees will come on their own. A DNA manipulator. Can I start making my own GMO plants? Can I please DNA to create new genes? Okay. 
Well, I don't think I currently have bits and bobs I need. Don't. I'll build it anyway. Right. Uh, bioplastic and explosive powder. I have one explosive powder. Um, two mushrooms and silicone. Silicone's downstairs. God, I've got to refresh myself. Okay. Got our bioplastic nuggy. The old golden nuggy. Explosive powder. Got zeolite and quartz. Zeolite, yeah. Alright, let's build it. Start manipulating DNA. I'll put it here since it's a nice little uh, area to view. What? How much power does this thing use? 117! Christ! There's me thinking I'm being looking to the future to prepare so. myself. How far off are we? Build more solar panels. Or is they just not pump out enough during the night? Even though it's 30. It's grand. It's grand. I have plenty of aluminium today. I'll go out and take a bunch of junk from these. I think I needed silicone though. It's always silicone. Why has the environment gone so murky and hostile all of a sudden? This is meant to be the Hand stage where everything gets beautiful. Okay, so I one. one. How do I need him? There's usually one lying around somewhere. Now, let's plunk that last one down and it should restore power. There we go. Life returns! Now, let's see what's going on in this DNA manipulator. I'm assuming I can make some sort of, sort of hybrid plants. What? I need a tutorial at least, surely. Oh yeah, recipes. Tree bark. One of those mutagens. Okay. And these give oxygen multipliers. So oxygen should go up nice and speedy. Um, I've not made any of these. Things yet, I don't know what goes into some bacteria sample. Right, like that. Here. Need water. Excite moments. I might finally get trees. So we have sulfur. Where did I keep the gas cans? Is that answer? And I think were any of the trees work more or less than the other? They're all one, two, five. I'll use I'll use whatever one I have the most of here. Do you think I have a lot of these blue ones? Back. I don't know what I'm meant to do with this now, but we'll find out in a second. Now what? Uh, start sequencing. It'll be slow. Go off and uh, find a pub. Is this doing anything? No, I'm just absolutely sucking my energy reserves dry. These are going up a little faster. I'm still miles away from 80. And my dreams of building the more heaters just went out the window. I could probably... What's the amount of power this thing uses? 11. That's, that's enough. Like, I think I built the river one here. So I could probably... I might destroy this. So, even though it looks cool. You're bleeding me dry. Now, I got super alloy from it. 
a little bit of energy back into the, the reserves. Just thinking what else I can destroy that could be... Well, that's probably wasted energy too, that's 15. I guess that'd be the tight arts as well though. Don't wanna... I wanna go to the cool base. I need more uranium. I've not found it anywhere yet. Alright, what else haven't I built? Shredder? Meh. <laughs> Veggie tubes. They're, all, they're yesterday's oxygen producers. It's these bad boys you need now. Right. Energy's 38 though. I'm just gonna have to keep building them. Um, solar panels though. I'll go over it while I'm waiting for the, the synthesizer to do its do its thing. I'll go to my little aluminium mining mining area. We'll see what's going on here. I would hope I have some aluminium built up. Or any Oh shoot. I didn't think that one through. But food level low. I'm always hungry. I need to find a way to restore my append appendix. I guess I grazing on the fields. But anywho. So far so good with the frame rate and stuff too. CPU is 41%. Dump all this in for the moment. I'll make the other rod while I'm here. Let's get rid of any excess bits. Well, I'll take out one aluminium and one cobalt to em empty my uh, inventory a bit. And that'll give me my much needed space in my inventory. Right, back to aluminium farm now. We'll empty out the aluminium from them yokes. We got terraformers going up. I guess it's the same um, problem I hit with a couple of terraforming stages ago. Where I might just have to like, leave it run on its own for a while. Stuff. I need silicone. This one's uh, this one's producing a lot. I think I might have actually put some chests in here for just unwanted junk. Yeah. Hello. Uh, put in there. I'll just drink one of the water bottles. Hey, this happened to be low. And perfect. Full inventory of the good stuff. Now we'll return to base camp. And we'll see what the progress is on the thing. There's burns and stuff starting to appear. That's good news, isn't it? Still the same number as before. I probably have enough to make two more um two more of these lads, do I? I do, yeah. Alright, let's make two more so I'll make another heater then. I'll get up a little bit closer to the I think that's all I had left. That gets up a little bit closer to the the nuclear reactor. Ain't gonna get there on our own. 
two oh and he spills some powder now so they use it a second ago. Oh we're both close into that. Two salt for an iridium. There's plenty of iridium if I go to my miner around the corner. Should have put this on one floor. On a midlife part for myself. Alright, three alloys. Two rods. I like the way all this grass is growing inside my little, uh, little base. Oh shoot. Hold on. I'm pretty sure I don't have 51 spare energy going around the place. I must put a window behind that one actually. I've been meaning to do it. I do. Two level critical. Alright, well, let's get this ad down. That's another little boost towards our next terraform level. What kind of power is this to use? 58. I shut you down anyway. I'm producing a bit of heat, I suppose. I'll, I'll keep going for a minute until I have a a reasonable reserve of this stuff. At which point then I might shut it down in favor of a uh, something else. So I guess I can't build another heater. I'm um, kind of low on iridium. Alright, what else produces like, uh, super alloy rods? Super duper. It's a lot of energy those. I think super alloy rods are yeah, the next stage. So I almost have one. I'm not getting here any faster. That, that seems to be the, the way to go. So I'll take this stuff too. I'll eat one of them. Eat the beans. I got some eggplants now too. I could probably exchange some of the eggplants for uh, mushrooms maybe. I think um, I have a few more things that need mushrooms. I don't have many mushrooms. Please. I still keep the eggplant going, there's one of them over there. And there's three of them, that's those. Right, we got three of each one. And I want to quickly build a mirror. Here, a window. Just to add a bit of extra brightness to this area. See what's going on outside. Alright, where are we? 3.8%. That's a long way away. Right, how do we make a super alloy rod? I need something I can craft. Maybe here? Yes. Okay. That's not a... Uh, overly hard thing to build. It's the energy. Minus 164. Like, I could shut down this gas producer out here. That would give me back another 50. I can probably go, actually the heaters and stuff over there, they're used to such like tiny amounts of power. 3-5, I guess everything adds up, but... What's this? The zeolite. I guess that stuff's coming along with um, the change in atmosphere now. Let's see more over there. Oh, well that means maybe then uranium and stuff might start here in, in other places that never appeared in before. Maybe, maybe. We'll just have to keep waiting. Iron back. Let's go a bit there now, anyway. That's another rod or two. So yeah, it looks like, uh, it looks like this is going to be a common thing to grow on them trees. It literally grows on trees. Now what do I need most of all? There's nothing I'm overly short on. Like I've got all the core stuff sorted out. I'll just take the iron just to free up some space. 
Yeah, there's something I'm sure on. Uh, uranium's it. Uranium is the Achilles heel at the moment of my... My adventures. And I can't think of where I would get it. I've never once found it spawning naturally. I think the only way for me to do it is to build more of them rockets that, um... That multiply... Something. And they'll make a bunch of meteors come down and get my uranium from that. But that's not cheap either. Those rockets require an awful lot of resources. I mean, you can't automate stuff in this game. Like, I can't automate super alloy. We should turn. It means I have to spend an awful lot of time making it over and over and over. Anyway, stump off some of this stuff. Not have a little think about this crisis, I mean. What to do? Like, waiting's obviously another option. I could just, uh... Leave it running a bit longer, get up another stage or two. Let me go to my sofa. Should get rid of them seeds. To see cover downstairs. Alright, um I'm not sure. I'm looking at this fella anyway, because he's very hungry. The drills. I could build just a bunch more solar panels, I guess. Keep going with the solar panels, that should grant me enough, maybe. I'm not getting enough stuff today, that's what's going on. I'm going to start destroying things. What can I build that uses lots of titanium and iron? Oh yeah, what do with the expansion or foundations? I do like the idea of an all expansion a bit. Let's build a little, uh. I don't know. Seaside resort over here. In case water sports ever becomes a thing. There was a very strong glimmer of blue off you. Look at that, they're very. They're, they're tricky into thinking they were the Osmium. I think this one's gonna fool me more than once. Why don't you like being attached to this thing? Nothing, nothing's happy around here. Maybe a couple of foundation pieces first. I would assume means I can then quite easily build up. No snapping though. Anyway. And your stairs. I don't think like small stairs exist. Oh, they do. They don't snap in the most centered of ways, though. I guess that's kind of. Yeah, At least I've done something with the resources. I'll eventually figure out what I'll do with the rest later on. I'll come back here later and build some more if I need to dispose of more iron and... Is that a cobalt around here? I don't recall that much stuff being around. But I wasn't picking it up. Maybe it's time just to go for another bit of an adventure and revisit places I've visited in the past. In the hope that... Common... 
resources that weren't common back then have now become natural. Maybe. Or just build another rocket and then in turn build another uranium reactor. But they the, the big fella requires three, I think. Yeah, three rods, that's like two or three asteroids worth. I just wait for that to get bigger and then I could probably get a snowball because well, maybe not. There's still plants that I have to get the number up on. How do I do that without. Oh, yeah! I forgot about this thing. Tree seed. Now, tell me this. Where do I put the tree seeds? Over right here? Where do I plant a tree? This one's just making bark in it. Not a fancy one on in here. Am I gonna eventually unlock like a a tree cultivator? Multiplier of 125% isn't exactly a big deal here. What other stuff can I make in here? What other disappointments can you produce for me? I wonder, can I put it into... That was spread it. No. We need to go into a tree spreader. Which doesn't exist at the moment. Hmm. Nope, be nope. Okay, uh, let's dump out the inventory and go for a quick spin. Revisit some places I've been to in the past. I want to see has there been a change in the environment. I think I might have explored too heavily at the start. I got too vinted. The exploration was fun. To hit the end of the world, gotta get them plant numbers up. The rookie numbers. I'll eventually figure out what the hell you're meant to do. Tree. Maybe I'll see if we have any gas out here. If we max out that for now, and I can give me a reason to turn it off. That's it. I'll just press. I think there's a button to dump it from your inventory. Might make a little pit, a jump pit. If things stay in there, they stay in there, and if they despawn, well, there'll be no tears. Okay, what I'm gonna try first is over here where I found the um, that cave that had a load of whatever you call that ore, the special ore in it. Yeah, these are all new. There's no way all of these cobalts weren't here before. Just in case something new anyway, it came to be in that other cave. If I can um, farm that stuff, it'd be great because it. See, it glow, green glow, it's just a plan. If I can farm that, it'd be brilliant though because I can deconstruct that then into pretty much everything. It's like a, a space saver. May as well grab the iridium while I'm here, because I think I'm going to be needing more to make heaters and stuff. Once I have the last heater done, though, well, do you know what I could do? I could uh, destroy the drills, because I don't think I need pressure anymore. If I destroyed them in favor of more heaters, I'd quickly get my generator unlocked. And then from there, I could focus entirely on organic stuff, plants, bugs, trees when I unlock the ability to produce them. For now, anyway, iridium is the, the glue holding that up here together. Unless iridium went into those other drills, I don't remember.
Alright, we've got a glitch. Yeah, there we go. Back on to the mysterious cave. The big door. We'll see what's going on in there. I wasn't sure what was going on there. It's like that. Is that sand or water? We've got water in the desert, anyway. That's a good sign. A good sign. Ooh. That looked awful weird. The way the grass was going around, I thought it might have been something. It's so cool. But anywho. Back to this mysterious cave, if I can get there without dying of hunger. I also need oxygen. Which I will get over here real quick. Be sure I have a, a base. Well, there's grass in the desert. That's weird, but it's happening. Ooh, I'm not sure I'll be able to get to the base on time. I know it's critical. I'm rushing, I'm rushing. Oh, it's getting dark. It's getting dark. Oh, there's the Lerma stuff. Another one. They've always proved themselves to be useful. Alright, let's go check the key. The mysterious cave. Keep an eye out the distance for anything. Cool. What won't that be? Can I come in for you? Not today. But it would appear entrance as possible at some stage in the day. Maybe I'll have to power up that generator too. Whatever. Let's push on. I think that crack over there is for the sulfur mines. But yeah, we'll see if uh, we'll see if the ore has respawned in here and if not, something else may have come along with it. Like, I don't want to have to keep doing trips around the, the game every time there's a new biome, a new uh, terraform level. So that we're seeing here, nothing. And I can travel the whole way around the map and find nothing. Time isn't exactly valuable, but... Better things to be doing. And now I've gotten stuck. special. Alright, so back to the base. Um, I'm not sure what to do about the uranium situation now. I need power generators. Well, I need a lot of the rare resources. I need a lot of uranium and a lot of uranium to make lots of heaters and power generators. Once I get to a safe space, I'll just double check and see what what are the resources required to make the drill and see if the drill had anything in common with the heaters. If that's the case, then I could probably ditch the drills and make the heaters. That will get me my nuclear reactor a bit faster, at least. And after which then I'll just pretty much deconstruct everything that doesn't produce oxygen. Because from there on, that's an oxygen and all of those sort of things are about this gonna get me on to the next tiers. Here we are. Home sweet home. Get in here quick and breathe at least. Okay. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. I'll just make a rod. Do 
you out of there. That's Norma Norma's upstairs. Choo -choo. There we go. I like to be tidy. Order. Okay, so a trail is. That was it. My super allies, it's nice to have some of them back, but it isn't going to help me build more of these. You will free up some energy. But this produces C2, 25 ain't much. It's crap, actually. This produces a bit more heat. But the, the benefits that come from a better ore extractor. But well, sure, what's that in me building? I'll make one anyway. I'll make one and see what it does. Uh, at this stage, it's heat, not terraforming. That's the problem. So, I think I've maxed out pressure. I have been. Okay. So, we need. Three osmium. Which I'll actually get from storing the drill. But we need two rods. One, two, two. Okay, so that's two rods. And now we need a super, super rod. Well, I'll destroy one of the drills out here first. These are hungry boys when it comes to power. That's a lot of super alloys back. Might mean I don't have to make any. Okay, super alloy. Uh, Two more and some aluminium. Just one short. Anyone who doesn't know here, you can make super alloy by using one of every resource. So I'll just make two. Super rod. Well, I'll build one. It's a bit rare or something outside the ground. Okay, so I'll just build one outside here and, and see what I can get out of my own front door before I start. It's, it's, you know, going off too far. I'm gonna make it easy on myself. Well, it stores more. Oh, low on power. Always low. Oh, low. Too low! That thing was hungry. Alright, let's just destroy the other... The other drill. I feel like this is a regressive move, but... Uh, things... Desperate times... Still wasn't enough. I get rid of this water thing too as well. That's not... Even positively benefiting the... Here it is. Still need like 30 more. Cobalt and aluminium. Let's build one down here while I'm in a rush. I think I need two though. God damn it! Just need more cobalt. It's always cobalt. Oh yeah, we need two. Need more again. And we're back. Right. Let's see what this bad lad type make of me. It's the only finding iron around here though. But what it could potentially do in the future is be my little ticket to Uranium, if I could find out where in the game uranium naturally spawns. But then again, I could go to all that effort, but by the time I get there, oh, by the time I get all that done, I'll have unlocked the next fusion reactor, I won't even need it. They have a lot of super alloys now. 
never has a rare chest been so full. No, the alley covered. It gets topped up now and then. Let's give us a little water. Drink a bit. Alright, so. Well, the bigger drill ain't that much better considering how hungry it is on resource. We'll see what it finds, but it's not that great. It would be I uh, probably better moved over to where the iridium is being created. You know what? We'll turn this lad off too. 117. I ain't using that at all. Waste my time. Let's get this stuff back in here. Probably should have done that instead of destroying the pressure thing. I know they were. Won't get me on my immediate goals, but they were helpful. Anyway, uh, let's make some of these then. Guess we'll get the that fertilizer ready. Good plant. I think the 400 is the best I have. Okay. Ain't much, but it'll at least produce some. More oxygen. We need two allies. All right, we're flush at the moment. But I don't need much more of the osmium than at the moment. That thing kind of goes up and down in terms of its demand. One minute I need lows, and next minute I don't need any. Here you go. What are we at? Plus one point three. That ain't bad. That much ain't making much at all. What's the first one cost though? It doesn't cost much. Barely any plants come from it though. Wait, well, it's not oxygen I want though, it's plants. 0.43. Yeah, consider that. Uh, well, not really. It's better. No way about it. There's no, there's no cheap way to get oxygen to get up a bit quicker though. It really costs an arm and a leg around here these days. But, let's see if you found me any gems yet. No, but it's not finding iron and um, two titanium. It's like sick death at catching this stage. Don't put him in the cupboard anyway. Yeah, I, I think the iridium, putting it over in the iridium area would be the most productive way to do it. Just because I'd get loads of iridium. Not that the one over there isn't producing a lot already. It is surprisingly good. I wonder... What's the button to get steam up again? Oh, wrong button. I always remember there being a button to get steam guides up. Do it a goo goo quick goo. Then again, as I said, find it and not need it anymore. Can it? Grab their uranium. How to get uranium. So it's down, found in storage crates, meteor events. In uranium caves with an ore extractor, right? Well, that means I need to go and find myself a uranium cave. I've not found one yet. Is there a, a cheat? And I'll just uh, show me to your uranium caves. Stage one melts. Here we get a block of ice. Yeah, we've got that much. Found the osmium caves. Gate Desert. A narrow zigzag stock kind of the shortcut to crack spires and aluminium hills. Coordinates are one. Okay, so which way is poly? Which way goes down lower? Definitely this way. 
with centimeters of uranium cave distraction, 538 minus 664, and that's a long. It's like, oh yeah, I kind of know that direction. That's where the good old days. It's be a bit of a pain in the arse to be uh, trekking back and forth though, just to get uranium though. I might find enough in there to keep me uh, keep going. There's another one then in pretty far away too. Hmm. The biomass ain't going up that much faster. We're still a long way away from where we need to be. Yeah, I can't see myself constantly trekking back that far for uranium. There could be enough uranium in the cave to build another reactor. One would be enough. It's just the heat. Need the heat. Yeah, screw it. I'll, I'll go and find the cave now. Sure. Give me something to do. But wait. Maybe I'll save it for tomorrow. This is going to be a big trek. And it's going to take like an hour. Oh, feck. I didn't mean to eat that. I was too hungry. Okay. See if I can fill this full. Do you have all these? Let's see, so that more stuff grows. Oh, this is organic here. Okay. So I need to go find one of the two uranium caves in the game, and I could build one of these here if I really need stuff. I, do you know what, I could bring it with me and dunk it down, leave it alone, leave the, the game running for an hour or two, fill up a crate and, and come home. I don't know. Let's think about it. The terraforming is going up quick though. I think oxygen is probably just the fast way to get me there. Not far away from this though. The heat wave, the heat one. It'd be nice if we could destroy all them. But yeah, I'll leave it for now. I'll do a bit of research on it so I'm better educated on how to quickly get myself more uranium. Deal with my power crisis. That's it for now. Flash you later.